This is non-calculated question number 13 from the April 2019 SAT. College Board is asking about a triangle inscribed in, inside a circle. If you have not already solved this problem, pause the video for a, a minute or so and come up with your solution and then compare it with how I solved the problem. In this case, we're told triangle FGH is inscribed in the circle if arc FG that's this, is congruent to arc GH, that's this. They told us the figure is not to scale, and it's clearly not to scale in my sketch, or in the graphic that College Board provides. If those are congruent, then these two sides of the triangle are congruent, and if two sides are equal, the opposite angles are equal. So the angles at F and G are equal, F, G, and G, H are congruent, and angle G is 30 degrees, so we have 30 degrees here. Let's call these two angles X because they're equals, so they're both X, and now what we're using is the fact that the angles of triangle add up to 180, so X plus X is 2X plus the 30 degree angle is all three angles in this triangle, and that adds up to 180. Subtract 30 from both sides, and I'm going to ignore the degree symbol from now on. So 2x equals 180 minus 30 is 150. Notice I always do the same thing to both sides of an equation when I'm solving an equation. Divide both sides by 2, because x is multiplied by 2 to get it by itself. I divide by 2. x equals 150 over 2 is 75 in degrees. That would be choice C. College Board frequently asks about triangles inscribed in a circle. I have a collection of videos on that topic and I'll post a link in the comments below. And come back soon for my next math video. With math there's always more.